Hi, um, my name is Harry and uh, my lab partner's name is Victor and basically what we did for our final project is make chess in Python using the command line in terminal. So basically um, we split it up into uh, three files and imported two of the files to our main file to uh, play the entire pro program. This is the uh, chess piece class. Um, it's basically a class that defines what a chess piece is. Here's our game board class. Our game board class takes in, um, basically has two classes, squares and the game board. Um, so basically our game board is just a 2D array that contains squares, which contain chess pieces. Um, importing those together, we got our game program right here, which takes both classes and then runs the entire program to play the entire game. So um, here we have valid moves, which uh, validate whether or not a uh, move is correct or not. We use slopes in the arrays in order to validate whether or not a move is considered legal. Um, here's a block move class. Here's the check class, which um, is continuously uh, checks the game board to see whether or not each king is in check. Um, here is the king dead class, which um, returns whether or not the um, king of either side is dead. Promotions for the pawn in case the pawn ever goes to the other side of the board. And here's the run, which puts all those Boolean methods together to uh, play the entire game. Here's just, you know, the main uh, couple of lines that uh, play the entire game. And uh, we're gonna run it right. So uh, here we have a little demo of our program. Um, I'm gonna enter the game. And um, here they just ask for the color of who you wanna be. And uh, the other players arbitrarily assign the opposite color. Here's our game board. Um, we use coordinates and uh, the rows are represented in numbers and the columns are represented in letters. I'm gonna enter the coordinates. Um, right now I'm gonna enter a square that doesn't have a chess piece in it and it will just pop a um, exception for me to redo my choice like that. And uh, the board updates every single time. The W, small W represents w, uh, white and the small B represents black. So if I add in 